In this video, I am going to talk about career prospectus of MD in Pharmacology. The first question is, what are we going to do in this three years course? And what is the work timing? The work timing in this is nine to four. And what are we going to do in this nine to four? Number one, we will be doing the animal experiment. And the next thing is taking the classes. So it will be uh, to the undergraduates. It will be for the nursing, dental or paramedical students, depending on the college, what you have taken. So which colleges are better to take for MD in pharmacology? So what I suggest is colleges in Mumbai and Delhi are better. The reason why Mumbai is preferred because you are in close proximity with pharma company and Delhi because of the stipend. Now the next thing is after I finish MD in pharmacology, what is the job opportunity is the question. There are three important uh, routes what you can take after you finish the MD in pharmacology. Number one, the medical college. Number two, the pharma companies. Number three, research institutes. Now let me talk uh, one by one. First, the medical college. What are we going to do in medical college and what are the prospectors? In the medical college, there is uh, something called junior residency or what we call it as tutorship for one year and the assistant professor for four years, associate professor for three years, and after you complete that, you are eligible for professor. Now, apart from that, what about the family time, free time? You will have plenty of family time, free time. You will have holidays. You will have the weekends. So work pressure is minimal here. And after four, if you are interested in private practice, you can also do that. But what about the salary, sir? The salary here is starting salary is uh, approximately 60 to 80,000. And as you get promoted, your salary also increases. Sir, what about the growth? Now, in a medical college, you will not get promoted so easily because the superiors who are already there, they are in that post. Unless they vacate, you cannot get the uh, promotions easily. So to become assistant to associate, it takes time. From associate to become professor, it takes plenty of times. And it depends on the colleges. Now, what about the salaries? Assistant professor, I'm telling you generally it is more than one lakh. Associate, more than two lakhs and professor more than three lakhs, I am telling the government standards. In private colleges, it may be lesser also. Then the second important aspect is in the pharma company. So what are we going to do in pharma company? There are two branches in this. Either you can choose a medical marketing or you can do pharmacovigilance. Sir, what is medical marketing? You join a company. There you have to give the inputs about the drugs to the company and you have to keep in contact with other specialist doctors and that will help the company to market the drug in a better manner. Since you are, you are in a medical marketing uh, company, you have to travel a lot. So traveling will be there. And what about the pay? Starting salary is 1 lakh and it increases year by year. But the work pressure is also more. Free time, family time is less. So if you want more money, this is the field. But uh, the work pressure will be there and family time will be lesser compared to medical colleges. But consider the money consider the free time, what you want, you decide. Then what about pharmacovigilance? Same thing, same prospectus, but pharmacovigilance is a desktop job. You'll be sitting there as a software engineer and uh, the work timings, it depends on the US or whatever the company they are tied up with. The last prospect is, is in a research institute. So if you are into the research, if you are curious into the research, my suggestion is when you are in PG period, start doing more and more research because research is the one which benefits the human human beings. So that's why. And there are plenty of opportunities in the research field, but the growth is slow. The pay is not that much great, starting salary from 80,000 and the growth is very slow. So these are the aspect and prospectus what we have in MD Pharmacology. But apart from that, if you are interested in startups which are helpful in medical field, you can do that. Apart from that, private practice can be done. So these are the few prospectors what you find in MD Pharmacology as a career. So if you are into the patient, you want to be a clinician, this is not your cup of tea. If you want to uh, relax, medical college, if you want to earn more, uh, you have pharma company. If you are interested, if you are research oriented, you have research institute. So that is what I had to tell you about the career prospectus of MD in pharmacology. So if you like this video, if you find this video useful, please like it, subscribe to the channel and share to your friends. Thank you all. Take care.